So a couple weeks ago, Atari, yes, Atari, is going to release the Atari 700 Plus, and I actually pre-ordered this guy. I'm kind of excited about this one. I don't know if you remember, about a year ago, they did the 2600 Plus, so a re-release of the original Atari 2600, which I was kind of tempted to buy it. I do have a Retro on 77, so I was like, well, do I need another console that plays Atari cartridges? Probably not, although I was tempted. Uh, but this guy, he kind of piqued my interest because you can see he's got a nice little wireless controller and runs the original cartridges. And of course, the new shell. And that's kind of my, my whole thing is like, oh, look at that shell. That just got the nice uh, rainbow logo on there. And now I'm kind of a sucker for that that, that design, especially the uh, 7800, 5200. I think they're really neat looking designs. Of course, the Atari 2600, very iconic. You can kind of see here's the joystick. And it does have a wireless joystick, and the 2600 does not have wire, wireless joysticks. Comes with a game on cartridges, the Crystal Quest. I'm not sure, this must be a new game. And of course, here's the nice box. You see what shows the game. The uh, What I liked about some of the other, other consoles, they actually released a 400 Mini uh, not too long ago, and this guy's fantastic. I tell you what, if you if you love Atari computers or just any kind of computers from the 80s, Atari 400 Mini, lots of really good games on there. Great joystick and great games. Really small little console, but uh, you, 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 of course you can't open the door and put cartridges in or anything, or use the keyboard. It's just, uh, just for show, which is fine. But back to the 7800 Plus. And I'm, I'm kind of excited. Mine, I believe, comes December 2nd. You can see here's the, uh, for a little bit more, I think this is probably the best way to go if you're going to do it. Uh, if you don't have any of the other stuff, the other consoles, it comes with, of course, wired joystick, uh, wireless joystick paddles, and, of course, some extension cables. Or you can buy a, uh, another joystick or a wired joystick, either one. So it's kind of nice. I actually think these are kind of cool to see that kind of thing coming out again. Really nice. Uh, they did actually do some really nice work. The, the 400, uh, Tired 400 was fantastic, and I was really impressed with that. Uh, kind of upset I didn't buy the 2600 Plus. You can still buy it if you want, but I'm going to do this one because, like I said, it plays both. It plays 2600 cartridges, 7800 cartridges. Same that the Atari 2600 Plus, 7800 cartridges, or 2600 cartridges. So you're not getting anything special or new feature that wise. It's more of the, it, now this is wireless. So let me know, are you guys going to get one of these and are you excited about it? 